when they fly, he tries to be still and sometimes he'll close his eyes. I can just tell him, this is a butterfly, you have to be gentle. And he knows how special they are. It's so funny when the butterflies sit on his nose. He tries to like look at them and looks a little cross-eyed. Milo is probably the butterfly's favorite flower. Milo loves farming and being in nature. When the roosters start growing, we go outside. He checks on all the fruit trees and veggies with me. We have chickens and it's really fun when you open up the coop to collect your eggs. He's like, I get one right. Yesterday we rode on the tractor together. He was like, I'm ready to jump in your lap and ride in this tractor. <laughs> Milo is a country boy. He's always my assistant in everything I'm doing. When you first get a puppy, you don't really know what he loves. And it's hard to communicate with each other. But once we got into the rhythm of it, it's like, oh, Milo likes the same things as I do. That's how I found out he loves the garden. And he loves working with me. So we started planting lots of milkweed and flowers. That's what makes a butterfly garden. And there was so many flying through. Milo's watching. Oh, almost done. I'm a florist, so we take the flowers from our garden and we make butterfly crowns. And Milo loves wearing his crowns. It is like so beautiful and so unreal. He's very like self-aware. He goes out by himself and smells all the flowers. He'll just go right up to a rose. He knows how good they smell. Me and Milo have a really close relationship. We're together all the time. We love to cook together and garden together. That just brings so much joy to me to see him so happy. And with a butterfly on his nose. It's time to watch more.